Well, today marks eight years since the Supreme Court ruled in favor of marriage equality. It set off celebrations around the nation. But where do things stand today? A new report called State of Pride paints a concerning picture. Take a look. Just hours ago, Governor Gavin Newsom's office tweeted, eight years ago today, the Supreme Court affirmed the basic right for every American to marry who they love. As forces of hate seek to undo this progress, California stands with the LGBTQ plus community as we proudly defend the right to live freely. Love is love. But look at this. According to the State of Pride report issued by California's Attorney General between 2021 and 2022, there were more than 390 reported hate crime events motivated by sexual orientation here in California. That's an increase of 29 percent. 45 reported crimes were motivated by anti-transgender beliefs in 2022, an increase of 55 percent. Uh, in order to be an accomplice and a strong ally in this work, we need people to speak up, to make donations, to volunteer, to, to be part of changing in the world. The report reveals nearly half of all gay youth seriously considered suicide in 2022 alone. Keep in mind, help is available. The Sacramento LGBTQ Community Center offers free counseling and community support groups. There are a lot of people who are still in need that we are all suffering in society after these last several very tumultuous years. We suffered through COVID and political unrest and attacks against LGBTQ people and an increase in hate crimes and racial injustices. Attorney General Rob Bunta tweeted, as we commemorate the landmark of Burgerfell ruling, we also recognize that the fight for LGBTQ plus rights continues. We cannot and will not allow bigotry to turn back the clock. You can read the full State of Pride report on our website, abc10.com links.